Let's not manifest that. out because it is less in my isolation a whole lot and um, it's fun to meet new people in a much more convenient way um, so yeah we're gonna be hanging out talking about our boy problems and everything like that and um, things of that nature um, yeah so join me along for the vlog make the bed and like clean the apartment so that it's decent enough for my friend to come over like I have a dull pain in the back of my head and like I just feel crappy so I'm going to rest and then go outside like it looks really clean in here and I've been clean for the past couple days and like um, I'm just really happy because my friend's not gonna have to come to a dirty place and I get to breathe, you know, like I don't like it when it's dirty in here and like I'm like too sick to be able to clean it because those days do come and like I, I fucking hate those days. So I'm glad that, you know, um, pacing myself for the past couple days has been has allowed me to, um, you know, um, have a nice clean place for me and my friend to hang out in. is it's like 80 degrees or so um it feels pretty good but like usually by this time of year it's usually like a hundred plus degrees 
and it, I'm not complaining I'm not complaining I like the long spring weather it's kind of weird for Las Vegas but um, I'm enjoying it while I can this like little massager that I carry in my purse in my backpack it's really good if you have chronic pain like literally you know something that you know you don't have to um, like carry or like carry and it's bulky or like you know um, have to plug it into the wall and stuff like that like you can just carry like this little one and then um, when you start feeling crappy you have it whenever you go out you have it you know whenever it's convenient. I'm probably gonna do the other ones later. I'm just too fatigued to finish all of them, but shit like I did about like more than half So I'm happy with that Like a mug omelet I've been looking at mug foods lately and I found out you can make mug pancakes so I was like okay like why don't I make other breakfast foods in the mug or you know whatever else you can cook safely in the microwave because sometimes like you know like cooking is just really dreadful when you have chronic um, pain and fatigue and things of that nature um, sometimes it's just really really dreadful and the littlest differences like making something that you can make safely in the microwave makes a big difference so um I'll actually be doing a video in the future about what foods you can cook safely in the microwave. Um, but yeah, like I put like different stuff in here. There's veggies, there's tomatoes, onions, um, cilantro. There's lots of different stuff in there. It's going to be good. glass while I'm thinking in my head mm -hmm. I mind my own I don't even break a sweat oh this matters is insane why you still live in vain I'm not the one you're the victim of your own mistakes it's time to hear the lights under the street lights under the street lights I called an adult activity bucket I actually saw someone online talk about it but um, it has different stuff in it like painting um, colored pencils crayons coloring books books to read journals like different types of journals it has a whole bunch of different stuff in it and it has like an affirmations folder it's very mindful and it's like so I don't spend too much time on my phone um, um, this time I was reading the African Goddess Initiation. That's a book that my friend uh, Gianna uh, let me borrow. I'll admit, 
today's been an unbelievably productive day. I don't usually do as much today. I think I've just been excited because I'm like, I'm filming today and I'm having my friend over. But, um, I do still have to pace myself, so I'm gonna lay down and read in bed and just relax for a little while. sucks is that they don't have anything about Malawi in this book. It's about like um, African, different African goddesses and stuff like that. And I'm just like, damn, like there's nothing about Malawi in here. Recording. I was just talking to myself. <laughs> um, so since it's a small space, I like to keep my guest chair next to my fridge so that it's nice and compact and just, you know, you can't see it. Feline chair. I got off off of Facebook market for three fucking dollars. Like, literally. I have my color changing lights on. If you know, for some ambience, you know. And um, I have Kiffin Beats on. Um, if you listen to Lo-Fi House, let me know. Because I like that little extra pop that Lo-Fi House has. Rather than um, the jazzy feel of, no or of normal Lo-Fi. So Pia just left and um, I had a wonderful time with her like I always do. We have great conversations, always talking for hours on end. And um, yeah, we had a wonderful time. Um, one of the things we were talking about since we were talking about our boy problems was that um, since she was telling me about like a breakup she was going through and I mentioned a breakup that I went through like um, recently as well. And this guy for me was an official boyfriend. Like he was just someone that I was dating for a couple months. And um, he broke things off with me. And then there was a neighbor of mine, a different neighbor than Mel. Um, so there was a different neighbor of mine that had a boyfriend and they got broken up with too. And um, I was like, what is it? Breakup season? Like this is weird. Why is everyone getting broken up with? And then she mentions Mercury Retrograde and she says that um, it affects technology and communication. And then she tells me how a lot of people um, get broken up with during Mercury Retrograde. I was like, that is fucking wild. Like to think that like something like that could like affect our lives in that way, like that's crazy. And then um, another thing we were talking about was um, around this time last year, we were talking about how the dating apps, just, they suck, you know, they're like annoying to use and blah, blah, blah. And um, we both mentioned that we both wanted a break from the monotony, like just a little bit of romance for a couple months or something like that in order to break up the monotony. And we both got what we wanted. We both were dating someone at the same time. And like it, that shit did not last as long as we both wanted it to. And I'm like, we spoke that shit into existence. Like we should be careful with our words because um, this breakup shit is not it. Say it, chief. That's what I would have told you. And next time, like we were both like, next time, let's not say 
we want just a little bit of romance to break up the monotony let's not manifest that let's try to like manifest someone that actually stays for a long time and like is actually like a serious relationship and um <laughs> it's just crazy it's just crazy how like you can say something you can think something and like you can attract that to you and like you got to be careful what you wish for because you just might get it <laughs> Okay, so Amazon delivery came while Kia was here and um, I have some groceries to put away. My wonderful sister bought these for me and um, yeah, got some healthy stuff and I'll let you know what I got. Well, I got some healthy groceries. Um, instead of getting ground beef, I got ground turkey. Um, I did get stuff for sandwiches, which is um, the deli meat and the lettuce, but instead of um, getting the bread, I only got the head of lettuce so I can make lettuce wraps. And then for easy stuff to make, I got minute rice, so it microwaves in like five minutes because fuck standing up. <laughs> um, and then I got these tortillas so I could make um, little like tortilla wraps for my mini fridge um yeah and then there's just some miscellaneous stuff Got me and then there's also eggs in my brain there's no blood serotonin not enough in my bed like love and my eyes seal shut and my mind feels numb get me for the things i said i'm not mad at you i had a really bad day barely getting through i feel like i've been on the same damn fucking loop i know that it's all in my brain but it's fucking true Cause i can't seem to escape from the pain i just need to break through the chains let me go please let me change Anymore. I'm just gonna flip over and shake out the board I feel like one day I'll regret this But I don't know how else I can forget this